Good morning to all. Thank you for the presentation. Um, our team today is establishment of diagnostic reference levels in computer tomography. Uh, I became on behalf of former student. Um, so our proposal in this study was to establish the dose reference levels in CT measurements in two regional public hospitals for each exam was made in the regions of the head, neck, cervical spine, lumbar spine, abdominal, abdominal pelvis, chest, abdominal and pelvis, and to compare the DRL between hospitals and with the international guidelines. So, our sample, it was 40, 46, 446, sorry, uh, CT exams. Our instruments were uh, 16 slice CT scanner in both hospitals, one CT detector, and um, a an head and body phantom of polymethyl maticrylate. Still our methods and materials. Initially, we performed an experimental study to measure uh, the dose rate of CT equipment. Uh, several measurements in the Phantom were made to assess the CTD doses. The values of CTD volume, uh, the ELPs, KVs, MIAs, type of exam, gender, and age were recorded. In accordance to institutional guidelines, the consent of the participations uh, was obtained from each patient uh, selected. So um, our sample were from hospital A and B um, in the total of uh, four, uh, 446 uh, CT exams, as, as I said before, and um, um, the 20 of that, 226 of, of them were from men with a mean age of 63.70 years and 220 exams from women um, with mean age of 60.92 years. So it's a, a balanced uh, uh, sample. In this table, we can see the dose uh, rate and the real value CTD volume and the control factor. We performed the calculations that allowed us to, to determine the, the real value of CTD volume and the control factor. Uh, this happened because there is no agreement, as you can see in the results of the table, uh, between the measure valid and the value displayed in the equipment. Uh, and if you, you see down here, uh, the, the percentage uh, are different in 75% uh, in the, in the body, uh, in the head, 83% in the hospital A, and the hospital B, uh, we have uh, a small, uh, higher value in the, in the body and almost the same in the head. So, uh, comparing both hospitals, we can see in the hospital V have higher values than the hospital A, uh, uh, excluding cervical spine that have a higher value uh, of DRL uh, by milligrams by centimeter. Uh, the results with significant difference between the two hospitals were the head, the neck, and the abdominal pelvis. Over here, we have the comparison uh, between values of this study uh, with international gu guidelines. And you can see the, the results are, are very interesting because you can see uh, comparing with UA, Portugal, with Portugal. These are two hospitals from Portugal, okay? So with Portugal, Switzerland, India, and France, we can see we have the lowest values um, in both hospitals. and. Uh, if you see the numbers, there are uh, big difference between uh, you in France in the head, and uh, is one of the most exams uh, performed. Uh, and and uh, if you see in, in the abdominal pelvis, we have almost the double uh, score, uh, the double value, comparing with both of our hospitals. And uh, chest, abdominal, pelvis, also the values from Switzerland, 
I think they are too, too, too much round values, so we don't know if these values, according with the, the, the reference, uh, these are the values in, the, in the, their work, so uh, we consider that they are true values. Uh, they are uh, the, uh, higher values. Uh, our values, uh, uh, we can include, they are the lowest values uh, uh, that uh, we observed in all of the studies. In conclusion, the radiation dose associated to CT exams is a huge problem and the concept of DRL arise with the main purpose to optimize the radiation dose without compromising the diagnostic quality. Uh, through the man uh, non-parametric test, we conclude that there are statistical significant differences between these two institutions for head, neck, and abdomen CT exams. In general, uh, the dose reference levels in both hospitals uh, are greatly, greatly lower than the international gu guidelines. Thank you.